enjoy candy? What about cake? Or maybe even ice cream? <laughs> I knew that you would. Well, what if I told you the next time you enjoy one of these sweet treats, that it would begin to follow you. Yes, follow you. And the crazy part about it is, you would be the only person that could see it. Imagine brushing your teeth and they're right there. Or getting ready to play Fortnite or even clean your room. And the eyes of a piece of cake, they're staring at you. <laughs> it's funny to think about, but seriously, what would you do? In the book Creepy Carrots, Jasper faces a problem very similar to this. Jasper is a rabbit. And we all know that a rabbit's favorite snack is a what? <laughs> you guessed it, a carrot. I wonder what will Jasper do when he encounters a case of the creepy carrots. Creepy Carrots was written by Aaron Reynolds and illustrated by Peter Brown. This Caldecott award-winning book is about a rabbit named Jasper. Jasper just can't seem to get enough of carrots. He loves them. Something happens, though, and he begins to wonder if they feel the exact opposite about him. Jasper's love for carrots is indescribable, especially the ones from Kraken Hopper Field. He eats them on the way to school and on his way to Little League, and he even eats them walking home. Then one day, as Jasper is tugging a carrot out of the ground, he hears a noise. It sounds like carrots creeping up behind him. When he turns around, the carrots are harmlessly poking out of the ground, just as always. But soon, these humble root vegetables are following Jasper everywhere. They appear in the bathroom mirror while he's brushing his teeth. They peer out of the windows as he walks down the street. And scariest of all, he hears carrot-like breathing in his bedroom late at night. What do these creepy carrots want with Jasper? Will he figure out how to put these carrots underground for good? Or will he become a snack himself? I don't know about you, but I can't wait to find out what happens next. Find this book and a host of others by Aaron Reynolds at your school or local library today.